Greetings and welcome to our Let's Play series. On today's episode, episode 63, we are going to be spawning a wither down inside of our shield. And hopefully, we can get another star. So, let's just jump right in. So as you remember from last time, we were spawning our wither skeletons inside of here. Getting them all up to, to drop some wither skeleton skulls. But the problem is, wither skeletons inside here won't drop skulls we're gonna have to figure that out hopefully soon enough to see why they wouldn't drop them but what i ended up doing is just spawning them in there and then just killing them by hand with my sword and they dropped them so it all worked out in the end but it's the fact that we had to go around quite a bit to be able to get all that is needed so the next step for us here is i'm gonna pull out this syringe because we are going to spawn the wither skeleton inside of here and then try to get an injection of it without dying mind you this is going to be fun so let's go upstairs for a second we'll take this we'll take this back and pop it right in there we'll grab a blank syringe we're also going to grab three pieces of soul sand. Uh, yeah. Oh, there it is. There we go. I think it's three pieces. Or no, it's four, I think. We'll take four. So, one of the things you want to do is you want to make sure that we get enough of the essence out of it with the syringe. And we want to make sure our little cage doesn't kill it right off the bat. So, we're going to have to make a few settings changes here so we're gonna go into our mob spawner here and we're gonna change some of the settings on our shield real quick so right now we have hostiles take solid damage so what we want to do is change that to just hostiles it'll just be solid and then we're gonna remove the solid damage for now and that's the bottom one let's work on the one that goes around it we will delete this one and add solid for hostile mobs again. So entities that matches filter cannot pass through. We will insert it there. So this should still allow us through. But prevent the hostiles from making their way through. So what I want to do is make sure we're going to have enough power here. Which we do. And then we're going to, we're going to flip these all off here. Yep, they're all off. This one's still, the beam is still going. It's dedicated, you know. Okay, so we don't have any key matter, bulk matter, or living matter inside of here right now. And we're going to try to spawn this wither. So, let's see what's gonna happen. I'm not sure if I should make a golden apple to go with this or not. We probably should. Just to try to prevent us from dying, we maybe should have some milk. We should have a milk section here to fall back into so let's go grab let's do those things real quick to cure us when we get withered because we don't really need to die it would really suck if we die so let's start with some golden apples i think we have some apples outside let's go grab some and then we're gonna need a bucket of milk so we're gonna have to go find our cows i'm not entirely sure where they went to an enderman helped destroy their pen and so now we gotta go find them okay so we have that we have a bucket so let's go find a cow i'm assuming they're here somewhere so i'll show you what happened the endermen were not very pleasant here as you can see so everything went underneath here Somehow. So we're gonna need to dig a little bit here. Okay, so all the pigs are here. Where's the cows? I don't know where the cows went to. They continue down here? No. And the chickens are gone. This is terrible. We don't have any cows or chickens. Well, we are going to have to go on a mission to find one real quick. 
So let's turn on our jetpack. Let's go find a cow. Just got it. Oh, we forgot to get the pearls. There we go. Oh, and another seed. Very nice. Okay, so let's go into this world here. I'm sure there's got to be one here. Amongst all the mobs. So let's see here. There's a cow right there. You can see my shadow. This cow gave up a lot of milk for our cause. That is very thoughtful of it. Okay, so we're good now. We have our milk. And let's turn off our jetpack. There we go. So the plan that I have for this is we're going to make a little milk pool that I basically run into to prevent myself from dying a miserable death. So let's grab a few more pieces of dirt. Okay. Now let's go back down in there. Or am I, I should use slabs. I'm going to use slabs instead of dirt for this experiment. Okay. Oh, we got to make the golden apples. I think that's just... Let's go gold. And I think we just surround it. Yep. But it's, Can I make the diamond apples? Maybe I can make the diamond apples. Let me try that real quick. So we'll take the diamonds here since we got plenty of them. And we'll surround it for the golden apple. Nope. Let's see what recipes. We have the golden apple we have the magical apple I wonder what that does that looks pretty weird and then we have salads of course the usual salads an apple tree apple yogurt okay so I am not seeing I am not seeing any for the golden apple it's not an easy one to make So, I think we're just going to go with, yep, oh, magical apples again. Okay, so we're just going to go with the, we're going to go with the gold one. Because I'm assuming there's no recipe for that other one. I mean, we could double check. I don't even see it listed. Yep. Yeah, it's not even here. Doesn't. Yeah, this one's only treasure chest found, so. Yep. We'll go with a couple of these to give us a little bit of a boost here. Leave that there. In case we're going to need it again. There's a high chance we could die here. Okay, so mob spawner oh I know what I need oh, I won't be able to eat it I'm too full eh never mind mob spawner okay so the plan I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna go like so so that as I run out of this room I'm back in this room can immediately jump into a pile a pile of two buckets of milk oh I can't put them on the ground maybe I can only drink them I might only be able to drink them so that's fine we're carrying it that's good enough and we have five of them so that's definitely a plus. So let's shift some items around here. I'm not going to need you right this second. We'll go like... Eh, we'll go like so. That should do it. Okay, so he's still beaming matter in there. I thought I turned these off. I did turn them off. That's weird. Hmm. Weird. Oh well. So, we have our shield set up. 
we have our milk ready to go so let's spawn our wither we might as well make this a fun little adventure here I mean what's the worst that could happen it's never a good thing to say why can I not place oh there we go okay now let's take our skulls here let's get out of here while it uh here. Let's eat an apple. Leave another bucket down. Grab our injector. Okay, so it took a little bit of damage, but. Okay, our syringe is now full. And now what I need to do is. Not as much damage as I thought we would. So we're going to add. A solid damage to hostile mobs. We're going to up it to the top here. BAM! Nether star. That's exactly what we needed. And some sulfur, I guess. So now we have our nether star to be able to spawn more of these. So what we're going to do is I'm going to remove the solid hostile damage. And we'll go down here and we'll take the solid hostile, we'll delete it, make it a solid damage hostile, and insert it. And they both should be set up exactly the same again. And we are ready to go. So we now have our syringe for the wither. It'll require the nether star, soul sand, and some material. I'll pull this out of here. Oh wait, we're gonna need to go down and so we'll turn this one on because we're gonna need tons of that. So let's go from our spawner here to the basement. And then from here, we're gonna go and remove from this one that there and then we'll click on this and we'll take this out we'll go upstairs here an enderman jumped in there that was definitely odd mob spawner basement nope. I'm wondering if it's raining outside it's not even weird He's here, and there he is, actually. <coughs> Got him. Not so tough. Okay, so we're going to drop off some stuff here. Like so, we're going to grab this view. We're going to place our buckets in here. I should really... Well, I'll make an extra bucket next time I need one. No big deal. Okay, so... Got our buckets here. Our carrots are going down like they're supposed to be. Got our one piece of soul sand. We'll put up our ender lily seed. We'll rearrange our inventory again. We'll even put our apples away. There we go. And we're going to move some carrots real quick. There we go. Yeah, that should give us plenty of carrots to start with because the matter should be building up inside there so yep we got the nether star basement mob spawner once so let's go in here and what we're gonna do is we're gonna tell it to start pumping soul sand in there Not really worried about this one right this second because it should be fine. So it's it's off, but it says it's pumping in there. That's really strange. Oh, but it's not. Thank goodness. 
Thank goodness. But we're going to turn it on anyway. And allow it to pump in for a minute here. So it doesn't take much for that one. And this one, we're going to allow it to get quite full. And then we're going to spawn 10 withers and watch them die. And get 10 more nether stars. It's a win-win situation, I think. And hopefully our system can handle the amount of withers that we're just going to spawn here. And pretty much watch insta die. So are you guys ready? I know I'm ready. So let's add this nether star here. And then we're going to turn this on. Do we have enough to make 10? So the answer for this one is yes. And the answer for this one is yes. So let's watch it go. That's all of them. Let's see what do we got left in there. We got some of the bulk matter and definitely the living matter left over. And we have just under enough nether stars. Wow, but we got 14 out of that. That means we got quite a bit more than... than we almost got 50% more. Yeah, yeah, pretty much 50% more than what we bargained for because we infused this block that is pretty awesome so wait for our system to recharge here and we're gonna need to find a way to upgrade it because it was killing our power if I put three nether stars in there maybe even four we would have ran out of power that's pretty doggone crazy but we'll get her figured out so let's call it right there we got 14 nether stars today this was a Wither Boss success. Thank you guys again for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.